This screencast will provide instruction on creating a on enabling the table rates and creating the CSV for the table rate shipping. First step is go to system configuration. Scroll down to shipping methods and go to table rates. In table rates you'll want to enable this. Change the title as you would like method name again as you would like and then set the condition as either weight versus the destination price versus destination or number of items versus destination this will stop basically decide how the prices will be looked up either by weight of the product the price of the product the price in the cart or the number of items in the cart so again that the weight of the pr of the cart, the price of the cart, or the number of items in the cart. For this instruction, I will use weight versus destination. Though you can use either of them. You can include virtual products in the ca price calculation, generally used for price versus price versus destination or number of items versus destination. You can add a handling fee, either fixed or percentage of the price and then specify the countries applicable to you can use either all the allowed countries or specify the countries you would like and to select more than one just hold down the control button CTRL and click on the countries you would like finally save the config and then we will need to create our uh, to export our table rates CSV. so in configuration scope click select main website and then you'll be back at table rates under the main website scope click export CSV and save the CSV once the CSV has been downloaded go to your go to the folder containing the CSV and double click to open it open your CSV you will see five columns in this column you will enter the country code as specified in the knowledge base article configuration setting up shipping methods table rates you will use the country code per the ISO 3166 country names and as you will see it is a two-letter country code so assuming you want Canada you will enter CA the region or state will be again a two-letter code as defined by your postal your uh, postal carrier I'm assuming for example British Columbia would be BC you can add a zip code specific zip codes that apply or you can have it as all zip codes and the same thing with the region you can either add specific regions or all regions using the asterisk weight and above for this you would enter a numerical value zero and above and then the price one dollar if you want to then have for the next weight and above you will do again country code region if specified BC and then BC again in the asterisk and then the weight and above let's say the next weight would be five pounds and then the next rate will be let's say ten dollars now for different regions you would then need to do this for the next region which would be I'm not sure what the code is but likely Vancouver's VC no specific zip code 
and you will need to then create your weights and above for this as well. Once done, simply save the CSV file. Click yes, and then go back to your system configuration, table rates while in main website scope, and click browse. Select the CSV file added, and then click Save Config. And your CSV would then upload if there are no errors. If there are errors, the system will inform you of them, and in this case, it's an invalid region. VC apparently is not the correct region, so you would need to edit this. In this case, I will simply remove it, as I do not know what the actual code is. So again, browse, select uh, the CSV once edited and saved, click Save Config. and as you will see the CSV is now uploaded as there was no errors then click default config under the corn scope and save the configuration again so that in the future you will be back to the default configuration and then simply test your rates in the front end